While I was growing up, it felt like my family was in survival mode most of the time. My parents emigrated to America and started a family here. While my mom and dad were hard at work in their small business, my two sisters and I were studying nonstop in the back room of the store. As a family unit, we all had our heads down and we were just trying to make it to the next day. So when holidays or birthdays came around, there wasn't much time or attention given towards celebrating those moments. Which would explain why, today as an adult with a family and two kids of my own, I go a little bit overboard for these celebrations. I admit, I overcompensate. In fact, I now actually have three Christmas trees I own and put up each year. What's the reason for three Christmas trees, you ask? Well, it's because I haven't bought the fourth one or the fifth one yet. But seriously, on a more meaningful note, now I'm so grateful to have the time and space to think about more than just surviving until the next day. And when Christmas comes around, I'm reminded of one of the fundamental verses in the Bible, John 3.16. For God so loved the world that he gave his one and only Son, that whoever believes in him shall not perish but have eternal life. When I think about this verse, it breaks down into four actions or four verbs. God loved, God gave, we believe, we receive. The four actions are loving, giving, believing, receiving. Of those four, I really do believe that giving is the one thing that is tangible and totally within our control. I mean, think about it. Right now, at this very moment, I have something I can give. And chances are, you have something you can give too. We can give money, time, energy, food, clothes, tools, a listening ear. I mean, the list goes on. We all have something we can give. And when we give, we actually give more than just the thing that we give. We give hope, hope to someone in need. That's what God did for us, and that's what we can do for others. That's what I'm choosing to focus on this Christmas season.